before I change my mind. Drax just walked right through him. Just want to point that and out. The lady don't and this like is, that was a cutscene. So he was supposed to walk right through him. Helby. Hey everybody, before this video starts, I want to remind everyone that everything you see here was previously streamed live. Make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for notifications when we do go live. You can become a member and rewatch any archive broadcast that drastically helps support the channel. Make sure you also join the Discord and follow me on Twitter and Instagram at amslabs for all updates on the channel. Enjoy the video. Doing some exploring. Have we done enough of that already? I'm pretty sure exploring is code. It means you went the wrong way, but it's too stubborn to admit it. In that case, Will's the greatest explorer I ever met. I have to like. Oh, okay. Yeah, just you know, turning water into ice. Go off. <laughs> I think I can see my house from here. What are you doing up there? Scout type stuff. Scouting. Looks like we uh, need to keep going towards the fortress and not away from it. Excellent work, Peter. Uh, that was some pretty good deduction skills right there, I must say. I would have never guessed that. Uh, okay, I so. A common monster hunter uniform. Like, are they organized or maybe even just a style? Would adorn themselves with come on why is the bridge always on the wrong side i could throw Touch me again and i paint these cliffs gray okay okay no throwing and no <laughs> shooting there's gotta be another way across we'll just look around lady hellbender let me guess she would have laid over the ravine and let us walk across on her back i was going to explain that she would have thrown the woodland creature guys i've got something here it's deep. This looks promising. There's little room to maneuver if something should attack. We're not gonna be here long. Anybody see a way through? Yep. Definitely something gross behind here. Cool. Pick up that boulder. Can you chuck that through the stink wall? That is... I love his fucking... I love his fucking animation so much. Smells like the time group throw up. Wouldn't that just be syrup? Am I wrong about that? Okay, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? He just throws up sap. How does he poop? Oh! <laughs> okay, that got my blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Because uh, it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter. Why would it taste like that? I can use this. You know, we really got to work on your taste, but The cage. You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress with our, with our monster peacefully walking beside us. We'll be laughed right out of the room. Any bites? Why are you whispering? And the more thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is, there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast, let me dispose of it, because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety is needed. Focus one at a time here. Oh, you got this one. Cut to the shanty. Maybe start making hands instead of tails. Throw that track. 
throw it at him. Uh, I'm just gonna unfreeze him. There we go. He's done for. Surely he's done for. He's not done for. Slake Buster. Cool. Oh, get him. And with everything. Nice. <laughs> I mean, does Rocket do anything? No? Okay. Come to me, beast! <laughs> you are coming with me. We better hurry. Oh, first rain. Then jelly. Then slimy, stinky crawl space. And now all these monsters. I hate this flarking planet! You hate everything, Rocket. True. But especially the stinky Let's horse around. Hey. I just went through the same crap you did, and I smell amazing. Ah, sure you do. It's my sexy hero, Musk. Group, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side. Of the bridge me. And we've already done this. <laughs> Deep freeze. Whoa. Can I try ice creaming something? Nope. Man, you're such a gas flat. <laughs> A gas flap? How much are we asking for our monster? What do you mean, Dolphin? We're running a business here. We need to make a profit this time. Hey, well, better not forget what we talked about earlier. I don't feel like I did that enough, but okay. It's nothing. Whoa, that is definitely in my top ten fortresses. How many fortresses have you seen, Peter? moderately amusing now we've got a ticking time bomb on the ship and we owe money to the cops all because of one lousy source guys every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet say that again what if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here only to find out lady h already had a full set that would have sucked big time exactly if we even got let's just get this done yeah fuck that dialogue Okay. It's farther than it looked. Much farther. It's a flarkin' infinity bridge, is what it is. Ah, uh, you're being dramatic, Rodent. Bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Three cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you? Oh! Right! Cage. The point of even getting the flarkin' thing is looking like the new business. Group, you ready to squeeze in? Are you? Peter Quill, there's still time to reconsider. The tree creature is not very monstrous. Maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Rock is the best escape artist I know. If things go south after the transaction, we're making the right choice. What? We voted on this. I don't feel right putting Groot in a cage. That's because it ain't right. Peter, She'll he... go for it. I think he's made his point. <laughs> Drat. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? 
What? Why? To guarantee your safety as a leader. Oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. I won't. Will you stop worrying so much? You're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. Dude, you know how heavy this would be with Groot, though? Holy shit. Whoa. Okay, whoa, whoa. A little bit close. They seem so peaceful here. I never saw a real whale when I was a kid. I guess this sort of counts. I'm sure it's real pretty, but can we not draw its attention while I'm stuck in a flarkin' cage, please? <laughs> Anybody have like a campfire song or something we can sing to kill the time? Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called. Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is please stop the name of your song? No. Okay. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. Oh god, Drax. 0 0.9, 2.1, 0.3 clicks, 4.5, 0.4 clicks. Oh, I can stop him. Oh man, I gotta keep going. <laughs> god, Drax, why are you doing this? Oh, we're going back in. Okay. We're going back to the beginning here. Extracts. <laughs> Thirteen whole years. Look at you. No. Go. I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. I'm not looking at all these posters again. I still want, I still like the flare one. You warm enough to spend the night in the yard? Is the voice quality audio is still horrible? The stars, wondering what might be out there. Mom says grandpa used to play this a lot when she was a kid, but it's been busted ever since I can remember. It's just one of the workbenches. Interesting. Well, well, well. No, nope, it's horrible. Finally, come up. Where's my cake? I warned you. <laughs> no, you didn't. I am so full. Mom. Oh. Okay, sit your butt down, slowpoke. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I like your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Oh, somebody's got a girlfriend. Is it Janie? Oh, yes. It's not Janie. She is so smart. Love Janie. Okay, I'm just teasing. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just ten bucks. Dan, Andy, and I want to go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. A movie? Tonight? Come on. It's going to be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were... Sleeping in my bed the next three nights. Uh, that was ages ago, and this one isn't even that bad. It's PG thirteen, and I'm thirteen. Exactly, PG thirteen may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just I, I wanted us to 
have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff. Or some of it. Tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house, and you know it. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you, I, I was... I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about. Something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. Don't you dare touch that dial. Okay. I'll look at the pictures. Wow, there's some actual photos here. You know, I was talking to Janie's mom the other day. Little guy put up a big fight. Wouldn't have been able to land him without Grandpa's tricks. Talking to Janie's mom. That's the bathroom. What the fuck kind of tub is... What the fuck? Hello? This motherfucker just got like a fucking... <laughs> what the fuck? Jeez, this is your house? I miss them so much. Grandma used to take me into town on Sundays to run errands. We'd stop for ice cream on the way home. Even in winter. Sometimes Grandma and Grandpa would let me sleep with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. Okay. Man, am I glad I finally got my hair the way I like it. Ah, it's amazing. Uh, I need... Oh, this way. I don't know much about art, but I know that this is excellent. This is mom's room? Be careful what you gotta find in here. I know she's lonely. See, there's tissues and everything. We don't want to be in this area. This is a nice place you got. Here's the box. I know it sounds crazy, but mom's convinced my dad was an alien. She really believes it. Could she be right? Price of freedom is steep. Chapter three. Fortress. Chapter three, dub. dub. Chapter four, the monster queen. So, as I was saying, I can handle a little solo extraction. No offense, but you ain't exactly invested in my safe return. My skin, my plan. Your call, Peter. Uh. It is. I'm the one in the box. Sign him with rockets. He's in the box. The burden of your possible death falls on his shoulders. Fully on board with Rocket's plan that I was totally paying attention to. See? Even Captain Space Cadet don't trust your gymnastics. Wait, what about gymnastics? I just God think we shouldn't be relying on a piece of tech. You won't even be around to use. It ain't yes, we're going to find out. Even you mouth breathers could figure it out. <laughs> Lame. Guardians of the Galaxy. Never heard of you. I'm good. Bonafide monster sellers. Today, anyway. What's in the box? A monstrous abomination from Halfworld and the meanest SOB in the quadrant. Pass. Pass? Rocket. I mean, Things puny. It is a hell beast, the namesake of your mistress. It would be wise to reconsider. All right, get going before I change my mind. Drax just walked right through him. Just want to point that out. Lady don't and this is, that was a cutscene. So he was supposed to walk right through him? Hellbeast? 
It is an accurate moniker. The little beast is a hellish demeanor. I like it. Not exactly an easy way out if this all goes to hell. It's gonna go great. We got a killer monster and a solid plan. I would show more caution, Peter Quill. If Lady Hellbender realizes our deceit, her vengeance will be swift. What? I'm supposed to be scared just because she's got hell in her name? She runs a glorified zoo. That's no zoo. The monster queen has a monster army. Any chance they're the zookeepers? With guns? I have never seen a monster's team. I have seen one trample a man to pulp. It's fine. Worst comes to worst, we hightail it for the Milano. Your genius plan is run away? Backup plan? <laughs> but yeah, Backup plan? Like chase after us with our old monster mash. <clears throat> oh, come on. Why did we not simply dock here and avoid the planets in the hospital's surface? Because Quill flies like a one-eyed badoon. We needed time to iron out the plan. Now it's foolproof. Lady Hellbender is no fool. When her monster goes missing, she'll assume it was us. Assume, yes, but not no. Not chased across the galaxy level of no, at least. Wow! Look at this place! I'm in the wrong line of work! It is appropriately impressive for a warrior of Lady Hellbender's stature. Someday, that's gonna be ours. Ha! <laughs> Not yours. Come over to your cave. Focus. Focus, guys. Time to get those game faces on. He means you gotta sell the illusion, too. Exactly. <laughs> I'm kind of halfway now, now. That is truly a priceless trophy. Dude, Drax is just walking. He just walked through Groot. He's just walking through everybody right now. Let's pull off a good, honest heist. No! Thank you for watching. Like the video if you haven't already. Subscribe for more content. Comment down below and check the description for links such as the Discord.